Hello everyone, this is Arush from SS Multimedia and today I'm going to be showing you the first part in solving the 4x4 Rubik's Cube. So let's get started. Okay, so I have the cube wall scrambled and ready to teach you how to solve it. So this is just going to be the first part on how to solve it. It's just going to be solving the centers. So the way we're going to be solving the centers is we're going to make little... Uh, kind of like cube thingies like these in the middle so you're just going to be making them on all the sides so let me scramble that up again all right so it's going to be basically like a three by three so you have your white here green yellow blue orange red but on this it doesn't have that so we have to manually make them but such as on a five by five there's like a little tiny center right there so yeah Okay, so now let's get started. So we already have a pair right here, and we're just going to be making another pair. So we have one right here and one right here. So if we try and move them together, they're not um, they're not attached. So what we're going to do is we're just going to uh, we're going to put this back for where it was, and we're going to move this part like that, so then we can put it together. All right, and then let's turn that so we can put that. Boom. Now we can do the yellow. So here we already have a pair, so that's fine. And here we have a yellow and a yellow. And it looks like these are already in the same spot, so we can just do it. So now the logical thing would be to just move it like this. But that ruins the white. So what we got to do is we got to put it like this. And we're going to go RW u2 and rw prime so now it's like that and they haven't gotten ruined now comes the hard part it's even hard for me sometimes i sometimes feel it too so uh we're all in this together so it's okay if you fail that's why i have my three by three sometimes always around with me so i can do this but i never saw my four by four that often so i don't really have it but well, for this tutorial, we're going to be needing. So we've already made the white and the yellow. Now we can make the green. So we'll put the green right here because right here, it's green. This actually could be anything right here. It could be uh, uh, red because they both are there. It could be blue. It could be orange. But I'm just going to go with green because that's the first one I saw. So let's look. So here's one green piece. So let's move that into its spot. And we're going to just, so we're just going to move it into its spot. And we're just going to keep these two to the side. So here's another green. So we can turn it like this and put it there. All right. So then here's another one. And here's another one. So we can put this one like this. And then we can put this one like this. And then we can turn it. And there you go. So now we have the green. Now, let's see what uh, is after green. So after green is red, so we get to do red right here. So we already have one red. So what we can do is we can find the other red. And then we can go like this. But then it's going to ruin our... Uh, it's going to ruin our green. So what we got to do is we're just going to move it over to the side. And then we can put it back. So it's still intact. This is still intact. We're all fine. And the other one is all the way here in the back. So what we're just going to do, we're going to turn it like this. And then we're going to look at that back one. And I'm just going to pull it up to the top. So now it's here. So now, again, you would think to go like this. But then it breaks. So what we're going to do is we're going to turn it like this. So now they're both at the same side. And we're going to go like that. So boom. So what I just did there was RW, U2, RW prime. So there we go. Now, after that is blue. So we already have a blue right here, so that's fine. And we already have it right here, so that's even better. So we can just go like this and like this. And let's do our thing. So it's RW, U2, RW prime. Everything's still intact. And lastly, oh, orange is already completed, so we don't have to worry about anything. Now, let's say it wasn't completed and it was something like that. At the end, you're just going to have to do that thing where you go RW, U2, 
RW prime. Or if it was like this, where it's like three like this and three like this, we're just gonna put them like this. So they're opposite to each other, one here and one here. And you're just gonna move this up, this to this way, and this back down. So there you have it. That's the first part in solving the four by four Rubik's cube. Thank you guys for watching. Subscribe, like, and share this video. See you guys. Have a great day. See you and bye.